Today I'm gonna to use Gilded Lily, and I'm gonna use whatever color this is. Um, somebody can tell me, one of my limelight ladies can tell me, but I'm gonna use Gilded Lily today and this, whatever this is. Um, this collection is really a good deal. Um, it comes in this neat little customized tin, like, um, and it has the Perfect Eyeliner Pen, which is an $18 value, and it has one of our new brushes that's coming. This is a deluxe eyeshadow brush. This is so nice. Um, it's This is the large shadow brush. Our large shadow brush um, in the previous collection, well, that we carry now, is an $18 value. But it's very nice and weighted, and you can tell that it's a very nice, expensive, professional brush. It's great. So you get the brush, the eyeliner pen, and all six shades for $88. It is a great deal. A great deal. You save... I, read, I can't remember, you save a lot. <laughs> um, so, I'm gonna, let's get started and I'll just show you how I do this. So, um, I'm just gonna just say right up front that these videos and pictures do not do these colors justice. Rose colored glasses, thank you Elizabeth. I'm gonna use rose colored glasses. So, I, am, I have my tissue here, my um, paper towel, and I'm gonna wipe my brush off. Um, I, what I have on my eye right now is just some eyeshadow primer. So I'm gonna take my brush and I'm just gonna dip it dry, it's dry, into this Gilded Lily. You see, it's, what makes eyeshadow professional is the amount of pigmentation. That's one of the things. Um, there's so much pigment, so it takes just a little bit. That means it's gonna last you longer. So even if you play, pay a little extra, a little bit more than you would for like a drugstore brand, you're gonna get much more wear out, much more, more use, or more longevity out of it. And this brush is great for packing the color on. I am just putting it on my movable lid. I don't ever go above. And um, see, I wish that y'all could see how pretty that is. It, it's so pretty. So, Gilded Lily. So, I'm gonna just do that. Tap it to get the excess off. It's a good idea when you're doing your makeup to do your shadow first. And that way if you have fallout, it doesn't mess up your foundation that you've worked so hard to get beautiful. See that? If you are a one color eyeshadow girl, you could wear this, put on some mascara and go. It's that pretty, it's that pretty. Um, okay, so for now, that's all I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a little something extra at the end with Gilded Lily, but for now, that's it. Okay, so now I'm gonna take this brush, which is the Smoky Liner brush, and I'm gonna go into Rose Colored Glasses, because this is a beautiful color that you can put right here, right in the arch of your brow. That's an okay place for um, mature eyes to wear it because um, it draws your eye up and gives a lifting effect, so you can do that. You just don't wanna put shimmers on the parts of your eye that are hooded or crepey because um, light reflects off of it and then it shows it up even more and that's not good. You can also use this in the corners of your eye and that draws the eye towards that area. It's really pretty, kind of brightens everything up. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Don't know if that's showing up, but it is really pretty. And that's all I'm gonna do with the Bare Metals palette um, because I need a different color um, for my hood my um, crease. So I'm gonna take my pointed blender brush and I'm gonna dip it right into my Ready Jet Set Go. And I'm gonna put that right into my crease. I gotta figure out how to see this. These colors together are so pretty. All the colors in our bare metals, no not bare metals, in our Feeling is Neutral palette are um, you can buy them individually. So um, you can buy them individually, they're $12, or you can get them in pallets of four, six, or all 18. And of course, when you buy um, more than one color, it's discounted, the price is discounted. So I am just gonna work this shadow in by using this brush and blending it, and blending it up. Okay, you know one thing I did forget to do. This is something that I did that I totally forgot to tell you guys. <laughs> I know the Lottie da I know. Well, the, the great thing about the Dazzle palette, and I hope they bring that back someday, is that it's a full face palette. You can literally use all six colors for your whole entire face and only that palette. Talk about traveling and, um, and making it easier on you. 
So I'm not finished with that because what I wanted to do was take, I want to wipe that brush off and I want to go into, um, this is cream boat and I want to just put a little cream boat here as my transition color, but it's not really that much of a color. But the reason I want to do that is so that my other colors blend better. And so there you go. So I'll get a little bit more of Ready, Jet, Set, Go. And blend. The biggest part about eyeshadows when you're putting them on is to make sure you blend them. You want a gradient look. You don't want any harsh lines. I feel like I got that way darker than the other one. So I can fix that. And then take a clean brush and really blend. These colors are gorgeous together. Then I like to take that same smoky shadow brush and go back into Ready, Jet, Set, Go. See that one? I feel like once I've closed my eyes for a period of time and I've been doing this, I have a hard time getting them even. See, even when you're a professional makeup artist, it's still hard sometimes to see. Okay, so I basically have it done. So now what I wanna do is show you how you can make a major pop of color by adding a little 10 years younger setting spray on your brush. So I'm gonna take that brush, this professional brush that you get with the Bare Metals Collection, spritz it with a little bit of um, our setting spray. I just depress it a little bit, and if you depress it a tiny small amount, you get a little bit of product, and then you don't have to waste a whole squirt. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna take that back into the Gilded Lily and watch what happens. I hope you can see. It's a huge difference. It's it's it gives you a foiled look. It is so gorgeous. Can you see that foiled look, you guys? You can do that with any of your um, eyeshadows. You can use water too, but the thing about the setting spray is that it does set it and it makes it last a lot, lot longer. So I feel like I need to just. So that is that eyeshadow look. I just used Gilded Lily and the other one. <laughs> what did you tell me it was? What did you tell me? Rose color glasses. Um, very pretty colors, very pretty colors. And then I used the Ready Jet Set Go. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a little eyeliner on. Now you can use, you can use the eyeliner pen that comes with it. I really like shadow for my liners, so that is what I'm gonna use today. And I'm gonna use um, Dial It Black. Dial It Black is from Our Feeling Is Neutral. And again, setting spray, because I want it to last all day, and it will last all day if you use setting spray. Um, you can use water, it just is not gonna stay like setting spray will make it stay. I, this is our Bent Liner brush, and this is just a great brush. Um, because it, it makes up application so much easier. And I'm gonna just drag it through my dial it black. Kind of, you don't wanna put a lot of setting spray on it. Okay. And I love it because it makes it so easy. I'm just gonna lay it on my lash line, watch. It's just so easy to apply it. Just lay it right down on that lash line. Because I have hooded lids, I don't have a lot of movable lid. Um, I don't like a thick line. So I get it right up in my lashes. And it really outlines the eye nicely. You know what I didn't do? I'm a goober. I forgot to go under my eye. Let's go under my eye. I'm going to take the Gilded Lily um, and I'm going to run it up under my lower lash line. I don't know what I was thinking. 
I have to get that other color off there. Okay, so that's there. And then I'm gonna go back into, sorry. Gotta get your, bye Elizabeth. But Kim, you can. Kim, just um, listen, girl. You just have to watch a bunch of uh, tutorials and you can learn how to do it. You really can. Honestly, you need the right tools. The right tools make all the difference. And, um, and good makeup. And then you can learn the skill. You just have to watch tutorials over and over again. That's how I learned. So now I'm gonna go back in with Jet Set. No, Ready, Set. Ready, Jet, Set, Go. And pull, drag a little bit of that darker color under there. Okay. And kind of meet up with those. Okay. There. Then I'm going to go back in with my dial it black and just lay it in the lash line. I think outlining the eyes is so pretty. I'm very excited to show you guys my new studio as soon as it's finished. But it's not finished yet, so... That's why you haven't seen it. It's gonna take that brush again and I'm just gonna smudge it in. Smudge. Smoke it out. I wish that you could see how beautiful this is in person. I did that um, the, the um, Pretty Penny last night and it was so pretty and I took pictures and I thought it's, it looks the pictures look okay but then when I went into my bathroom to take my makeup off, my one eye that I did, um, I just was blown away at how beautiful it looked in just my natural light in my bathroom. It's just so much prettier in person than it is in these pictures and on the videos. Okay, now I'm going to do mascara. I'm gonna curl my lashes. This is a Prima eyelash curler, I love it. Um, it's nice because you can control where you crimp. It's exactly like your regular eyelash curler. It's just more narrow and you do little bits at a time, but you can you can get super fast with this thing. I'm usually looking in a much more zoomed mirror than this. Hard to do it. I don't know that you can even see it. Y'all, y'all, do you see how pretty it is? Um, and then I'm gonna use our perfect mascara, and this has built-in fibers. Our mascara is $20. Um, the fibers don't flake, and they don't, it's not a mess, it's a one-step process. And if you are someone who has hooded eyes, droopy, saggy eyes, mascara is the one thing that will absolutely cover that up and open your eyes right up. Our mascara is also buildable. So you can put as many layers as you want. Um, but I, my lashes are looking pretty good these days. See that? Okay, and a little bit on the bottom lash. And then we are done. If you guys are interested in having this palette for yourself and you want it for the holidays, you need to shoot me a message Give me your lovers information and I will make sure you get it. Put it on your wish list and send your wish list to me. Okay, and there you go. And that's basically it. If I wanted to, let's just put a little bit more on the tips here. Them a little bit longer, and that's it. Isn't that pretty? So go go get yourself some bare metal metal.